Oh, good workout tonight for the boys. Um, um, commend the boys on the professional performance. We wanted to win the game tonight. Um, we've won the game. Um, there were some good passages of play, uh, some good goals scored, and, um, and obviously keeping the, the concentration defensively as well uh, to keep another clean sheet. So it's, uh, so it's a pleasing night's work. A good chance to get minutes to some of the lads who've not had that, that game time yet. Yes, correct. You know, um, Silla's been here. We wanted to give him volume. We gave him a game tonight. Same with Theo. Theo's uh, got some minutes as well. Um, Canberry as well. He needed some more minutes to top up where he's at. So, a real all in all, um, a good workout. And some of the younger players that came in, Fizz come in, done really well. And um, and young Kieran Brennan uh, at centre back. Uh, Joel playing in goal tonight. So there were some changes tonight, but um, all of them can feel. Uh, pleased with their performance tonight. Good confidence boost for Facilla to score in his debut as well. Yeah, that's what you want. You want your attacking players uh, scoring goals. So for him tonight to make his um, debut for the for the football club and to score a goal can only do him um, uh, wonders in terms of that. So we're really pleased. Um, players come off the pitch on the scales, which is what you want. And it was a good workout um, tonight for us. Got to mention the new signing we brought in today. Said, oh, Barahino, what can you tell us about him and the, the decision to bring him into the club? Yeah, really pleased to bring Saido here. Um, somebody that uh, I know really well, um, somebody that I've worked with before, uh, and somebody that can um, give us more attacking options. Um, Saido works wonderful off his left and right foot. Um, his link up play is really good, and obviously, being, um, he's a goal scorer as well. And if he gets chances in that, you know. Uh, it'll make the opposition keeper work or put the ball in the back of the net which is what we want really so to have him and have the opportunity to bring him here I wanted to bring him here and I'm, and I'm glad that uh, everybody working together was able to bring him here uh, and we look forward to when he arrives uh, and getting some work into him and him um, being another, um, another player that we wanted to bring to the club and we've managed to get him got the international break now what, what can you tell us about what the lads are going to be doing in this time with, without a game on Saturday yeah we'll work we'll work um, we look at an opportunity to work and um, now that the window's closed um, and we've got the bodies in now what we just do is just work now and, and get that um, get that group cohesion that understanding and uh, get them together and uh, get them understanding uh, one another more so and use the opportunity to work really and and that's what we'll do now. Um, we'll finish tonight's game. We'll give them tomorrow off, and then um, we'll come in and work from Thursday onwards. And we got the rest of this week to work, and all of next week um, before we travel down south to the Plymouth game. And just finally, an update on, on Massimo Longo and, and his situation. Yeah, Massimo. Um, we, in terms of he's, he's got a um, hamstring um, strain or pull. Um, we're really pleased because um, at one stage we thought, you know, it'd be an injury that would keep him out for a long, long time, probably up until the new year. But I'm pleased to say that's not the case. Um, and, um, you know, he'll be back now uh, rehabilitating with the medical team. Um, and we look forward to getting him back um, really soon. So it was great news, really. We wanted him to see the specialist just to make sure. Um, and the specialist has diagnosed it's a, um, it's a hamstring muscular injury. So um, he'll do the rehabilitation with our medical team, and hopefully um, over the course of the next few over the next few weeks, or however long it takes for it to settle down and getting back on the training ground working, um, that'll be down to the mass in the medical department.